Today, we try and beat Risk of Rain 2 as Mithrix himself on Eclipse 8. How strong is the final boss of the game in the game's hardest difficulty? Let's jump in and find out. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the first ever Eclipse 8 video on the Trento Mento YouTube channel. Today is obviously not a normal uh, Eclipse 8 run, if you will. Uh, we are Mythrix today, obviously. Today we're doing Mythrix on Eclipse 8. I did a Mythrix video a very long time ago. Go check it out if you have not already. But on that video, I had a comment a thousand years ago that said, hey, you should try Mythrix on Eclipse 8 because obviously he's very strong. And I said, sure. Now I'm only at like Eclipse 4 in normal like Risk of Rain in my own climb. But I figured this would be a good start to kind of figure out how hard it is. But this is going to be a little bit different than a normal Eclipse run. Our needs are quite different from the usual Eclipse run. Usually you need a lot of damage. Mythrix has plenty of damage. We need healing. As you can see, our base regen is extremely slow. Been here for a minute. We've gained probably one health the entire time because we can't really like avoid damage. We have a couple dashes we can use, but a Teddy's gonna help. Really, we just need a little bit of a better way to heal up. Anything like a Bungus, a Wongus, any percent health, foreign fruit, super helpful. Anything like that is gonna get us there. Oh, a Power Elixir is actually massive. That gives us a full giant heal. Now, of course, Eclipse 8, we are at half healing, so it's not the best thing ever but that's extremely helpful. Our equipment is a vase. That's a free pillar skip. I'll be, yeah, that's a good, kind of a thing I didn't think of. We didn't, we don't, we have to do pillars if we don't have the vase all the way through. I think I will keep the vase then till the end. Another thing I should have mentioned is we are phase three Mythrix. So our slam obviously has a shock wave that goes with it. We have our little swing and a couple dashes, but most importantly, we can jump. Okay, this is the same Mythrix I used in the first video. We slam back down on the enemies with a shockwave. And if I use that ability again, I can pizza. Now, I think I'm going to save pizza for the actual teleporter fight. Because I don't really need to do it now. It's a super efficient way of getting rid of aerial enemies. Because I, I could do this, but literally I didn't even kill one wisp with that. So it's not a very effective ability for ranged attacks. Uh, so we'll show off pizza during teleport. Here are a couple things to keep in mind with Mythrix on Eclipse 8. We will die to fall damage. And maybe you cannot prove this. Maybe I already have. Maybe this is the third time recording the video. Because the first time I didn't click record. The second time I died on stage 5. You don't know. You don't know. Uh, but yeah, we will 100% die to fall damage. And the dash does not negate any. In fact, it might even increase our velocity towards death. So anything to keep us from dying of fall damage, we can find head stompers. This is a free win. This is honestly kind of like the reverse of normal Eclipse. We don't really need speed. We don't really need attack speed. We just need uh, healing and like damage reduction and, and fall damage help if possible. That's really all we need. There's nothing else to this run except for just making sure we eliminate all the biggest threats using pizza when we can getting good green items not like leeching seed okay, leeching seed is an immediate scrap we just we just don't need that in our lives you know what i mean that kind of toxicity doesn't belong here a couple items we're looking for i'll head over to teleporter now and do it we're looking for razor wire roll of pennies repulsion armor opal is pretty nice actually wandering vagrant let me show you pizza i'm gonna go right now under him and boom we get to do pizza directly under the wandering vagrant do a ton of damage and i'm not in the teleporter zone that is unfortunate we do get an old war stealth kit decent little loot from stage one but there's some key items we're missing out on okay stage one has been finished uh we maybe should have scrapped into the opal although I don't really know what I would have gotten rid of. I guess the mocha. We don't really need mocha, do we? Granted, attack speed is actually really helpful uh, because that changes the speed of all of our animations. So pizza happens way faster. Just normal attacks happen way faster. We get to get out of our animation locks way quicker. Monster Tooth isn't terrible because it's based on max health. So we're not looking at like a two health gain we're looking at two percent health gain not too bad oh we did fall okay that's okay oh i did it again oh okay i hate that little gap that's silly 
We have to very much watch out for fall damage. And a quail maybe should have been avoided. Ooh, I think I like egg a little bit better than vase. I don't know if we can pillar skip with one egg. I'm gonna have to make a decision at the end of the stage. Cautious slug isn't really what we're looking for here. I will say volcanic egg does in fact though give us uh, the ability to not take fall damage. And that's one of the most helpful things we could possibly ask for. So I'm not too upset about that. Repulsion armor, one of the items we're looking for. So that's very helpful. All right, it's made two mistakes in one. I missed i misclicked and missed a bear and picked up a sticky bomb and then i put my equipment equipment drone luckily we have the other volcanic egg that popped out right over here so now we have an egg drone which i don't think will last very long at all and our own egg hold on was that a bungus printer what was this oh a watch printer uh, see you wouldn't expect me to be upset by a watch printer but i really just want healing oh my goodness we actually have bungus i want to make sure we are picking the right one massive Heal time, baby. Look at this. Oh, look at the heals. Thank goodness. You have no idea how badly we needed that. Oh, there you go, egg drone. You get him. You get him. Now with one Bungus, I feel like infinitely better with what we have to do here. Clay Dune Strider. Ready? Watch this. Hold on. Let me just get up on this. And I'm just going to jump here. We'll do enough damage by landing on him. Come on. Boom. <laughs> That's great. I wish I had any sort of band that would be massively helpful unfortunately we do not uh not the end of the world but a band would be very helpful in both my other runs i had a band um a game ahem i would love one of those here we go our pizza egg. you take out the clay dude's right here take out the yep the clay templar is done as well i see a wax quail that's our second one uh i didn't notice a scrapper i'll take it but it's starting to freak me out a little bit. Bungus also helps during pizza, because you can see, unless something moves me, I'm literally just healing while pizza which is so enormously helpful. All right, Void Cradle, give me, I guess a Wungus would be cool. Void Scent, I don't know about that one. I'll pick it up, I guess. It's more damage. I don't have a Will-O-Wisp yet. I would rather Will-O-Wisp, but it's not terrible. All right, unfortunately, no sign of a Scrapper anywhere I was looking. We came up empty. Rally Point Delta works for me. I can go get the newt really quickly. No place to fall off, which is great other than over here. We'll try to avoid doing that. Nope, it is not here. It is at the other spot. I would love a roll of pennies. Again, we have a scrapper there, which is nice. Roll of pennies makes these stages so much faster. And a razor wire would just like save us right now. I see a lot of blind pests. I'm trying to heal up. Let me jump. Uh, because I'm gonna need a pizza here. There's a thousand enemies around. I need to start clearing house a little bit. There is way too much going on. There's a blazing golem I want over here, sir. I would like to pizza everyone. This is gonna hurt. Oh, it didn't. Let's go. I think we just gotta commit. I just got a pizza. Hope we don't die. Take everything out. This golem is gonna hurt a ton because of the fire. Stick out as many wisps as we can. Please, fire wisps. Don't live. Uh oh, I think it lived. This is not ideal. Oh my god, we got razor wire. Oh, we did it. We actually, we're free. We're free. As long as I can, like, smartly stay in good spots and not get hit by giant shots like that. I don't really want to use our power elixir right now. I'm going to go heal. But as long as we play this relatively smart and we use that razor wire, we are in business. Because that is one of the best items we could find. And another bungus. Oh, it's big. Oh, it's big. Here we go. Heal, baby. Look at the heals. Oh, it's beautiful. Okay. Uh, hey, guys. Code green. Bungus printer. And there was a scrapper somewhere. I know I saw it. So this is wonderful. Here we go. I'm going to let him do damage to me. Watch the razor wire go into effect. Bang, 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 bang. Everything just dies. Razor wire to him. Oh, we're in business. And we got a band. Yep, now we're doing some damage. Now we're doing some damage. Ronald's band comes in huge for the slam. Almost everything we do can proc bands, which means uh, happy me. All right, I scrapped four of my white items. We're going to go one, two, three, four. <gasps> Oh, it's lovely. I think we are good for teleporter now, actually, especially with the Bungus. Let's find out where or what we're spawning Clay Dune Strider up here. Don't love that. I'm going to get hit by the fuel cells. Please don't kill me, fuel guys. Please don't kill me. Okay, that did not do nearly as much as I expected. Let's do this and let's pizza in a second. Yo, 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 yo. Chill, 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 chill. Chill, 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 and also chill out. Why did he spawn up there? Why did he have to spawn up there? All right, I'm going to take out this guy. We're going to focus in. We're pizza in here. This should kill this guy. No problem. If I die here, I'm going to be very sad. 
But look at our Bungus fight against the damage we're taking. Come on. Take him out. One more. That'll kill. <gasps> okay, I thought it didn't. That's good. Uh, this guy is getting healed, which is big cringe, and he's gone. Love to see it. I have scrapped five greens because we're going to uh, the newt. This also means that we can choose our stage four. Come to learn through my last attempts that uh, Abyssal Depths, I cannot reach the legendary. I am too large and big. So ideally, Siren's Call is best. However, fall damage of... Ooh, ah, that's actually kind of trash. My dash isn't that good. I'm going to wait. Uh, I think I want to just let Fate decide. Because both of these I could die to fall damage really easily on. Abyssal Depths, that becomes a lot harder. And we are given Abyssal Depths. That's actually huge. Some Insin Drone on the ground over there. A couple of drones, a couple of... Lots of drones going on. Let's go find the stone titan. Hello, sir. I've come to take you away. Goodbye. That is a ton of damage. I think we will mess around and touch a mountain shrine. I, I think we do. I think we do. I don't think that's a huge deal. I am not too concerned. Look at the pillar damage on this. Wow. We got our first gasoline. I didn't realize we didn't have one because all the runs are meshing together in my mind. But gasoline, very, very helpful. We have a Teddy printer. If there's a scrap, we might go into that, you know, four or five times. Yo, what's all the drones? There's like 100,000 drones in this map. I mean, like, it's fine, but they just die really quickly. Oh, sir, what are we doing here? Razor wire, do your thing. Do your thing, razor wire. Get him. Get him. Bang, I'm going to hit him there. If I get bleeded at all, I will just be razor wiring everything, so... Kind of hoping we get a little bit of bleed on us. Not a lot, but I'll run through these guys to get that razor wire popping, killing everything around. Oh, I walked right into that. We're fine. Nothing to worry about. Goodbye, Imp Overlord. Give me the cash that I require to open some chests. There is a scrapper. Yeah, we're going to teddies a little bit. We're not going to go, like, all in. We'll do anything crazy, but, like, four or five teddies, hello, is a significant amount of blocked damage, and we don't need, like armor piercing i mean i guess we do it helps but we don't need all the items we have right now so we can get rid of a couple for those we will grab a fire band as well the chant shrine is empty all right we'll keep moving on oh we got a gun okay we got a gun we have to remember to come back and get the egg very very important but a trophy hunter on this stage could be massive honestly one of the best things we can get might actually be a neural Come to think of it, Neural might be the top. Is that that include that is increased regen? Is it like a percent health thing? I don't know. I got to figure out exactly what it does, but that could be enormously helpful. Do we Mountain Shrine? I think we do because if, oh, if we get an overloading worm, oh, it's over. We're going to be in a great spot. We're given a Red Whip and a Death Mark, neither of which I actually want, so I'll probably scrap both. I'm pizza and we can get mad money from Gups right now as long as we can keep them on the platform. Oh, 2,100 gold. You're actually joking me. That's insane. Also, Berserker's Pauldron, I think what... What actually gave me that attack speed? Oh, was that, uh, that's Predatory Instincts. But that attack speed, as you can see, is super, super helpful. We got, an, and now we actually got another Berserker's Pauldron here. All right, let's take a ton of fall damage. Oh, none? Oh, let's go. A Bottled Chaos? Oh, you know you. I should have waited until, uh, I was sure there was no Recycler. Oh, no, I didn't even see that. Okay, well, uh, we're gonna... Oh, we took the... Oh, the gun. That's fine. I was worried we got rid of the egg. The gun is fine because we can actually still use the gun as long as we have that drone near us. It'll aim at the boss, so that's not the end of the world. We still have our egg, which is huge. Oh, no, we did give our egg away. Oh, no, I thought I had the, the Trophy Hunter's Tricorn in my inventory, so no egg for us. At least we get to guarantee the, uh we get that boss item but that is unfortunate i'm gonna start to buy these drones up there's so many of them i don't really know why there's so many but we'll grab a couple before we leave i guess you know what? i think we're good to do teleporter right now we can get everything else we need before we leave let's just hit it hoping for that wonderful oh charge perforator yeah let's go and we mountain shrine oh jesus lord three charged perforators you're actually messing with me right now that is insane if we can get that to proc wow yeah it just procced on that uh, that elder lemurian just from a slam three charged perforators is crazy teleporter is clear with five thousand gold 
We should be more than fine to loot the rest of the stage. Wow, that is a lot of hermit crabs. Big chest, give me, oh my goodness, we got drone man. Okay, every drone is getting picked up on this map. This is actually a game changer. Drone Man makes this a totally different run. And now we can scrap and print into teddies right here. I don't like the spot. I know there are hermit crabs around. I'm kind of just looking for them. Unless I got them all, we might actually be safe. Okay, six white scrap. I think I'm keeping everything else. Let's get into some teddies. Seven tougher times is feeling wonderful. All right, we're bringing the Ahoy hat right into the next stage. I think there might have been a forgive me please here. I'm not 100% sure. Here we go. We go. Stage five. Do not take any fall damage if we... Put, what the heck is that kind of start? If we potentially take any fall damage... We do have teddies to help us maybe survive the drop, but we cannot rely on it. It is very scary to rely on that kind of thing, and I do not trust it. I do not like any of these enemies over here. I'm just going to keep storing shockwaves over there. I would love to... Oh my god, wait, hold on, I forgot. We are... That is going to hurt. That one's going to chunk. Oh, it's not... We blocked it, baby. I need to heal up a little bit. We'll go over here, get our bungus ready. Here we go. Heal time. Everybody chill. No worries. Don't shoot at me. Don't do it. That is so cringe. <laughs> You're not doing it. You're not helping anybody. Here we go. Void Jailer. Not really a fan of you. Do not Void Jail me. I will be very upset if you Void Jail me. I mean a bad... A, no. Stop that. Stop. You're going to Void Jail me off the map and I'm not about it. I'm not about it. No. And you're gone. Please be gone. Go. Get him out of here. There we go. Here are some giant explosions. Kill everything over there. We have a Mending Lemurian. That's just terrible news. Oh, there is a Z construct here. Don't love that. Uh, ooh, hold on. Do not fall off the map like this. Oh, I hate that. I'm so glad I have dashes. This is frightening. Our movement speed is almost a little too high. And we just picked up a Hunter's Harpoon, which certainly doesn't help that issue. Drone Man is putting in the work, though. They are all getting hurt. And hopefully Teleporter isn't a grandparent. But, uh, you know, our drones are, are doing what they're meant to do. Let's see if I can get the Z construct. Here we go. Get him! Yep, that'll do it. That'll do it. Get out of here. We gotta play this so safe and so smart. It's actually crazy. We just got two bunguses in a row. We're feeling good. We're feeling good. Give me a good equipment I can bring to the moon. Wood Sprite? Honestly, wait. That's good. Oh, finally we get the roll of pennies right now. I guess I'll do it. I have two chant shrines that are over, uh, like, thousands of coins just to buy one. So I'm just gonna wait. Let the roll of pennies do its thing. We'll do teleporter, won't fall off the map, and we should be good to go. Our void potential gives us this option. We're definitely taking med kit. I didn't see any void cradles, which isn't my favorite thing to announce. But I do not think there are any. I think we have looted enough. This is the farthest we've got. Let's activate the primordial teleporter. What do we have? Z Construct isn't great news, but I can not quite hit it. I am going to jump because I do want to pee. Oh, my. Oh, wait, hold on. Actually, it's just that easy. Leeching seat, gross. I didn't see a scrapper while I was on the stage, so I think this might be the loadout we... <gasps> no shot. Oh, my God. Thank goodness. Thank you, Teddy. Thank you, Teddy. I really appreciate you. Oh, my goodness. I had a, I had a heart attack. It's the dash with, like, uncontrolled speed that really gets you. And we need to stop with this. This needs to... You, we need to end what's going on in here. I need to have a clear path up so that we can just... Boop. Okay. Okay, let me just... Boop. Get up there. Get up there. Good, 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 good. Okay. I don't want to be anywhere near the edge. I'm not dashing at all for the rest of this teleporter. We're not going to dash a single time because the dash is simply way too much momentum. Teleporter is done. Now I could loot a little bit more. I could go look for a pillar skip, but I do not want to risk falling off this map. So we're out of here. To the moon we go. Look at the healing though. Holy, look at the healing. We are now full health. We have a razor wire. We have uh, two repulsion armors, not too bad. And we got a whole lot of bungus. So pillars obviously will need to be done. We have no way to get up there. No vase, no egg. But I like Wood Sprite, actually, as our equipment. All right, sir. Uh, I don't know how to hit you because you are very fast. But I'm going to try. That was good. That was actually really good. Hold on. We got him really hard there. Okay. Okay. Get him. Okay. He's kind of not really dying, which is weird. But I will smack him again. Dash this way. Okay. Okay. He's way up there. I don't, I don't like how, I'm just gonna, you know, I'm just gonna go. 
I'm just gonna go. He's gonna deal with my drones. My drones will do damage to him, I think. As long as they don't stop attack. Did he die? Whoa, the drones are strong. We do have seven green scraps, so if I can get over here without literally killing myself off a ledge, I really hope I do not. I would like to print something at soups. What do we have up there? Interstellar desk plant, nothing here. ATG, do we have any ATGs? We do not. Uh, there is a white printer, which is that. Nothing over here. Let's check up top. Ceremonial daggers. That's actually pretty solid. I might take desk plant though right now. Purely because uh, healing, right? Heals for 10% of maximum health. So it is a percent health heal. And during pillars, that's going to be extra helpful. Now, I really don't want to get flung off the map with this. Because I know... Is it going to push me? Oh, no. Our mythic. We don't move. Okay. We're fine. We'll just, we'll just chill here. Uh, we should be able to do pillars no problem. I'll kind of walk you through it with me. And we'll fight the big guy who is also me. One design pillar is done. I'm a little bit stuck. Where is the other one? There was two, right? Two design pillars. Was there? It might not have been. Am I wrong? Here we go. He's the one. We'll do this. This is good that we get two design out of the way. Uh, we'll probably have to do blood. But we have two repulsion armors and... Oh, this is good. This is why repulsion armors are so good. He literally stopped attacking me because he was doing no damage. He was like, oh. Oh, shit, my bad. We do have two blood pillars. I want to get over there literally as safely as I possibly can. So we're just going to do a little walk. We have no feather. Uh, oh, this actually is a little bit of a problem because I can't just, you know, skip through this little gap, I don't think. I kind of have to take it from another angle. So we're just going to risk it all for the biscuit. Here we go. Big risk. Jump. Oh, we make it easy. We make it easy. Let's go do blood pillars and finish this thing. Let's have Bungus set in. We'll have two repulsion armors. Here we go. Ready? I'm not even worried. I'm just not even concerned. You know what I mean? It's just too fast. I just sit here and I know this is going to hurt. So I'm going to leave. We are going to dip a little bit. Now we can go back in. We'll just finish the job. Finish the job. Cool, cool, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Let me in there. But Teddy's helping out. Teddy's, I looked it up. Oh, uh, well, I didn't look it up. I looked at our stats. I'll show you in a second. 51% chance. So on stage five, we had a 51% chance to lose the run. Ready? Here we go. Where is it? It is 51.22. Absolutely terrifying, but luck was on our side. I actually don't love what's happening here. Uh, I actually have to make a weird jump that I don't want to do. So I'm just going to jump for it. And we make it, we make it, we make it. Now, I cannot die here. We just dash one time. Cool. And get me up there. Please don't mess up the jump. Just put me where I need to be. Don't hit the bottom lip. Get me right up here. Over the... Yeah, beautiful. All right, Mithrix. I am Mithrix. It comes down to this. We have one curse. That is no big deal. We still technically have one shot protection. It is Mithrix v Mithrix, but I have an army of some drones. That's going to be mad helpful. We are going to jump early. I'm going to try to get some charged perforators on there. That is a band, which is beautiful. I can pizza phase one really easily. We don't necessarily need to, but uh, certainly an option. Sir, sir, please relax. Please relax. Boom. Good damage, though. This is going to be a little bit of a battle. I'm going to have to jump pretty smartly there. I don't want to, you know, throw anything away. We're going to have to do this intelligently. I'm going to beat this Mythrix with Brain, not Brawn. He's up again. He's at about half health, which is great. We're moving. I mean, our drones are actually massively helpful right now. I cannot lie to you. Hopefully, we do have 45,000 gold. Actually beneficial that we had to do pillars because now we can buy back any of the drones that fall. He's chasing me. But drones, get him. <laughs> okay, good, good, good. We'll get in there. Uh, I'm a little concerned about... Oh, my. That was actually mad quick. I'm a little concerned with pizza. Not super concerned, but we'll have to very much watch out for it. I'm going to let my drones take most of this phase for me as I'm not going to need to do a whole lot here. Yikes. Okay. Drones, you've got this. I believe in you. None of you are down yet, which is great. Great job on your part. I'm going to take down the guys on the floor. You guys take down the guys in the air, and I think we'll make a great team. All right, almost set. I'm going to let you guys finish off this one so I have a ban for when Mythrix comes down. I'm actually I'm going to try something very bold. I need you guys to finish this off. I'm pizzaing right here. Here we go. Ready? Right when he comes down. This might be a terrible mistake, but I'm going for it. We're pizzaing right away. I'm glad I didn't land in that, but we're just going for it. We're just simply going for pizza. Now we can dash away. Woo! Okay, that wasn't that great. I don't know if I'll pizza again. 
We might just make sure that we are focused on getting him as best we can. I can shockwave him, he can shockwave me. We should be able to do this slowly. We do have one drone that has died. We pick him back up. Go back in. We can hit him here. Dash out. He's going to pizza very quickly. Pizza's like right away. So we'll be ready for this. I think we should be able to avoid this pizza pretty well. We are Mythrix indeed. And we have decent little movement speed. Oh, there we go. Beautiful. Okay. Drones. Drones. Pick him up. Pick up all the drones. Pick, 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 pick. Beautiful, and we're up in the air. I actually don't love this. We're kind of really high up. Oh, that wasn't that bad. He jumps again. He is low. I really kind of need to phase four skip, though, uh, especially harder with Drone Man. So, whoops. Here we go. Whoa, that was close. That was really whoop. Oh, I'm going to get hit by that. We re he really doesn't really do a lot of damage to us with pizza, luckily. But it is mo most certainly more beneficial to avoid pizza than it is to take it if he jumps i probably might i don't know if i can quite phase four skip here i'm gonna try though i am most certainly going to try mythrix come on oh that was not enough damage at all as long as we can avoid this pizza we can buy back all of our drones and just quite frankly go for it and cool 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 Ooh, i don't know why i did that i thought he was done i thought he was done drone 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 all the fireworks should end our phase three here. I'm going to keep going. Okay, now we buy everything. Now we buy every single one. Buy, buy. Obviously, we're not going to have Drone Man, but we are Mythrix, so phase four shouldn't be nearly as hard. Mythrix is used to, uh, you know, a normal fight for phase four. So that's a lot of items, though. He does have Teddy, and I don't love that for us, but we are doing damage. We are doing damage. Do I get fireworks back? I do. We'll hit this. Jump over these guys. Slam, beautiful, get out of here. Don't get shurikened or banded, love it. Okay, oh, okay, 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 okay. He still has charge perforators, so let's be very careful. I also don't have drone man, so I'm a little bit concerned here. Uh, cool, let's do this. Very risky, very risky, I went for it. Charge perforators are back in our inventory, love that. Drone man is also back. Come on, drones, finish him off. Do your, yeah, there it is. Mythrix has been... Do it, drones! Defeated! Mythrix Eclipse 8 has been completed. Oh, but don't worry. Don't worry, ladies and gentlemen. We can still throw. Let's go to the good one. Uh, we can still definitely throw here. I'm just gonna... Oh, I missed the jump. Ooh! Whoa, that was close! We just have to survive charging the ship. If we do this, then Mythrix Eclipse 8 has been completed. My first Eclipse 8 victory. We have 28 curse. Not too bad. Pretty average for a Mythrix fight. Honestly, I'm going to jump. If I jump, I'm perfectly safe here. It also allow me to pizza if I want to. Uh, I don't really need the pizza yet. But if anybody gets too close, screw it. We're going to pizza. I'm pizza. Is it? Uh, yeah, it does. Wow, I actually hit that guy dead on. Uh, we'll pizza just for fun. At this point, it's purely based on entertainment value. Eclipse 8 Mythrix is a W. Only took three tries. Who knows? Maybe the first try would have been a win if I actually clicked record. I don't know. I just stopped. It was like stage four. I just like stopped the recording. Uh, but second try fell off the map. Third try fell off the map. But Teddy's coming in oh so clutch with a coin flip. Saved the run. Mythrix Eclipse 8 has been done. The items that got us there. Drones, actually almost the same amount of damage. Drone Man, very important. What a great grab out of, I don't even remember where we got it. Probably just a large chest, I would imagine. But 1.3 to 1.1 took 34,000 damage. Certainly a lot, but very fun stuff. If you guys want to try this for yourself, mod links are in the description to get like Eclipse 8 before you actually unlock it. And obviously Monster Mash to play as Mythrix. Hope you guys all enjoyed. With that being said, I'll see you next time.